guys, it's Nakai with House of Meese, and I am here actually for a Christmas home decor haul. Um, people have been asking me to do home decor hauls, if I could do more of them, of them, and the truth is I haven't been shopping for home decor. For several reasons, you guys know, we are trying to finish up our house so we can buy or build a home, and just, I'm not, I'm more so settling in to everything. I feel like I have things that I need, and I'm trying to just work with what I have. However, Christmas is a different story. I actually used all of our Christmas decor last year in our house actively. Like there was a spot for something and we still needed more Christmas decor. Well, neat. I use that term loosely. Um, so I basically bought some stuff this year and I think I'm done. I don't know. I, I say that, but I honestly haven't gone to Target yet and I know that Target has some really good stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. The first couple of things I'm going to mention I actually got from Lowe's. I'm just going to um, add in a clip here of the things that I got and you guys can see so I got a welcome rug um, we don't actually have an outside Christmas rug so I wanted to get one and it just says welcome really really nice I love the red and has snowflakes on it and then I also got two outdoor reindeers we actually don't have any outdoor decorations for Christmas or any holiday to be completely honest so I got one of the reindeer that they are kind of like sitting up and they light up we'll put them in our yard and then another one that's kind of like eating the grass so to speak I got both of those for really good deals I think they were like 40 or 50 bucks which is an amazing deal um, and we picked up both of those I think that's gonna be it for outdoor this year besides like Christmas lights um, but yeah those are really really nice and then moving on really quickly to Walmart, I didn't get that much stuff from Walmart either. The first thing is just this gorgeous tree. It's actually a four foot um, like snow tree. It has like the flocking kind of look to it. I'm not entirely sure where I'm going to put it, but I loved it. And it was only 18 bucks, you guys. Can you believe it? And then I also got a couple of things that are actually from Walmart, like the store or like normal stuff. You guys know what I'm saying. Um, first off, I got this cute little these little reindeer these might go on will probably go on um our tree in our bedroom because that's kind of the thing that we have um so i got two of these they're not very well made to be completely honest um but they're cute if you don't look at them too too closely <laughs> i also got three of these like oh i kind of broke this one it, they're made pretty cheaply three of these christmas trees once again i don't know where i'm gonna put them and then they have like a little moose or a reindeer inside of them really really nice they're just from the little holiday time collection from walmart and then the last thing i got i thought would go outside it's like a little shovel it says welcome friends and it's a little shovel with you know little foliage and all that stuff on it and it is just something you can easily hang up. So I might hang this up outside of our front door. I haven't decided yet. And this was $4.47. So I got that. I also forgot about one more thing from Walmart, which I will just pan it in because I didn't bring it in here with me. It's actually a countdown. We don't have a countdown for Christmas. And I, this one was a snowman and it has little days with little blocks you can switch out. So I just picked that up. It was really, really cute, really inexpensive. It's all already on our um entryway table which is why i don't have it here with me right now and then this thing just because it's all alone or by itself um i wanna i bought this mailbox from amazon i'm gonna spray paint it like a burgundy color instead of this bright color i don't really like the whole bright bright red for christmas i'm gonna spray paint it and then maybe paint this silver or something like that and um put it on our entryway table with some little pine cones coming out of it there was actually a bigger version of this at kohl's but i really didn't want to justify paying for it i felt like it wasn't worth it and um i just made I, i'm gonna make my own smaller version speaking about kohl's we will move into kohl's and the first thing that i got is this i love this i think it's super pretty i love i just love the whole snow slash flocking i think that's what it's called um thing on trees i think it's a gorgeous gorgeous thing so i love the wood that it comes in it has little bells on it which is super pretty and this will be good for a really really nice centerpiece it has like i said burlap it just it's up my alley okay so i also got this spoon rest which i thought was too, super super cute little snowman this was 14.99 and it's um they had a lot of cute stuff in this like snowman thing and i really wanted to buy plates and stuff but i honestly don't have anywhere to put them right now so I didn't know if I wanted to buy them and just let them sit until I have like 
a china cabinet or something. But anyways, I might go back and get them, I don't know. But it's a hand-painted little spoon rest and it's super cute. Um, I also got this picture frame. I try to get picture frames around the house because I realized that for when I decorate for themes or things like that, I don't put pictures for like the previous year. So I wanted to, I've been, I did it last year and I wanted to make sure I had a picture frame to like just put just a regular picture in. And then the last thing that I got from um, Kohl's is actually an ornament. I want to start a girl's like collection of the Snoopy and things like that. I actually might even go back and try to find like on Amazon or eBay or something like that the previous years that the girls were born. Um, the years like the keepsake little ornaments. So I got this Snoopy one and it was a teeny tiny one and I just want a tiny one for their like a really really small tree and this is Winter Fun with Snoopy and he's just reading a Christmas Carol. Super cute. Hopefully you guys can see that. Okay and then moving into we'll go with Michaels. Michaels recently they were having a sale on their Christmas stuff and I believe they were 40 or 50% off. Um, so I got some stuff from there. The first thing is this, which I thought would be nice to put one of my bigger Christmas trees in, or even this tree. I don't know how big the base to the one I got from Walmart is, but, um, it just says Merry Christmas. Love the wood. It's, it's adorable. Right up my alley for Christmas. Um, which, they're, it's really, really nice. So this was $14.99, and it just, like I said, it says Merry Christmas. It has handles on the side. And then the other stuff that I got, it was really simple and sweet. I got this door, which I saw it and I loved it. It's actually meant to be for like an ornament. But I might make some type of like, you know, small little scene somewhere um, on my counter or something like that with this door. I think it's super cute. It doesn't look anything like my door, but it's really cute. Like how adorable. The next thing that I got is this hat. And actually, um, Michael picked it out. So it's like shaped like a hat like a top hat and then the inside of it is open so that way you can put something inside of it. Michael actually picked this out and he liked it so I went ahead and got it. I mean if I can get him to like commit to Christmas decor then I'll, I gotta support it. And then I picked these up and he thought it would be cool to put them inside so they're these little um like floral little arrangements and these were $8.99 or no sorry $5.99 and then they were you know half off essentially so I got the normal one which just has the pine cones on it and then I also got the ones that had the little berries um so I got two of them with berries and he thought it looked good with this and I thought so too so I'm gonna definitely use this because he thought of this all by himself um, and then the last thing that I have are just these small little balls. I have a small Christmas trees that I got from Zulula like a long time ago. And I wanted to decorate one of them with, I have like my um, Christmas spoons from William Sonoma. But I wanted some balls to put on there and these match the spoons. So I got these. These were $5.99 with the percentage off and they're just red and white. Pretty simple, but I thought these would go really, really well. Now the last place that we went to was actually last night um, after we went out for a friend's party and they are, um, it's at home. I don't go to at home too often but we were out, out that way and so we stopped in and I got a couple of things. So we'll show you. So the first thing that I got is this pillow. I can't tell you guys how excited I am to decorate with pillows finally. So our other pillow is just, or our other couch was just not really really nice so it was hard to decorate with pillows because it didn't look right. But we have our gray couch now and I'm excited to put some pillows on. So I got this pillow which is upside down but it says deck the halls, um, all that good stuff, joy to the world, all of that. And it's just a white pillow. Michael said it's not going to stay white and it probably won't but it was super pretty. And then I saw this and I thought this was super pretty. I don't know where I'm going to use it for. It's actually I think meant to be a spoon rest again but I'll probably use it for something else. Like I don't know what but something. It, a little mason jar it says tis the season to be jolly this was $4.99 it was super cute it was the only one I think maybe it was either misplaced and sat there or it was just the last one but I picked it up because it was way too cute we also got this my husband does not like putting up lights on our house because we have really steep um uh really steep like like a, a, a roof is really steep you know what I mean like we have a bunch of the points and it's really hard to get up there and they were struggling last time to get lights up 
So I was like, you know what, it's fine, like we won't worry about it. So we decided to get a projector instead. Um, and we're gonna try this one out and see how it works out. But this one is the um, LED light show projection Whirl of Motion, and it's turning whirl swirling lights. So I don't know exactly if it's just the little, it looks like it's like a Santa and a sleigh and stuff like that. I don't know if that's all that it does, but yeah. So we probably will just do the peaks of our house and not like the entire part of it because it's a lot of work. So we got two of these cute little hangers and they're just little, um, little jingle bells. And it has burlap with all the little things on the ribbon and stuff like that, super cute. And I think I'm gonna hang these. Um, we have lights on either side of our garage door. I thought these would look really, really pretty. So I'm gonna hang these up really pretty. Once again, just the brown and the burlap and the darker red with the green, it's just, it's my style. It's just what I love. So these are both $5.99 uh, and they're super cute. And festive. So I also got three of these, um, like this is from their holiday hold down collection. <laughs> I guess both of these were and they were like burlap and woodsies things and they were really cute but these were $1.99 they're little candy canes I thought it would be once again really really nice on our Christmas tree or um on the little flocked Christmas tree that I got from Walmart but it has a cute little bow on it which is adorable with the button and then it's just burlap with some red ribbon tied around it so I got three of those and the last thing that I got is like another Christmas countdown, but I thought it was super cute because I thought it would be perfect for the girls to like put a little like Hershey's Kiss inside of it to count down for Christmas. So they're all, they're, um, it's a Christmas tree which you can hang up or you can let it stand. Sorry, it's kind of big, so I'm trying to work through it. Um, <laughs> and then you can count down how many days until Christmas from December. So I thought it would be really cute to just put, um, like two Hershey Kisses in each of them and let the girls have them like that night before they go to bed. I think they're gonna love the whole chocolate aspect because we normally don't do anything like chocolate or anything like that every night. All right guys, so that is it for my haul. I know it was a lot and I, like I said, I think I'm probably done. I might go to Target later on, like closer to the season once I've started decorating and I realize like, oh, I would like to have this, that or the other. Besides that, I'm pretty much done. So, um, this is plenty for a year's worth of Christmas hauling. Like I said, I love Christmas. It's my favorite time of the year. Winter in general is my favorite time of year. So that's why I kind of do the most. And then all the other seasons and holidays, like barely get any decoration. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed. Please give the video a thumbs up. If you shopped at any of these places or got any of these things or found some cool finds for Christmas, let me know down below in the comments. And I will see you guys in the next video.